Hey guys, welcome to the first part of our Resident Evil Let's Play. And uh, let's get started. Resident Evil Revelations. Yeah, it's Resident Evil Revelations. Uh, I haven't done any. I'm going to do a full Let's Play on this one, actually. So let's just get all this stuff up going. I already got to the uh, display options and everything. So, we're just going to check out some stuff. I tried to play online. But I didn't get to it. So, yeah, let's just get right into the campaign. Uh, provide a hearty challenge. Test your loves and say Let's go on normal. I usually play on casual when I'm playing Resident Evil games because I suck ass at them. I'm gonna get further away from the computer, actually. Just give me a minute. Okay. That should be far enough. L plus B to do a quick turn. Probably wrong. Um, we. Fan I didn't have fucking subtitles. God damn. Fuck, I skipped it. I thought I could pass it. Split screen. Uh, options. Play. That's brightness. Audio. Let's play some. Oh, it's already on. What the fuck? Okay. Let's go. Oh man, this looks pretty cool. Can I say you aim? Oh shit, what was that? I'm just peachy. Where are you? I guess I have to go in here. I might be able to shoot it off. Oh really? Bam! I want to do a uh, big ass kick and open. Open. A Is there anything I can scavenge? I didn't read any reviews on it with this. Freaky looking bastard. Ugh, it smells like rotting flesh. Really now? I wanna expect a dead bot on oh, god. I wanna Anything in here? Skin scavenge. How do you know what there's like something here? Open game settings. Oh. Uh, display map. Whoa. Should be something here for the uh, things. Default. Okay. Aiming speed. Default. Uh, swimming controls. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, guess we couldn't do anything in controls. I kind of hope we could have. Uh, probably gonna turn controller vibration off. So you won't hear the rumbling. Okay. I'm gonna like super kick that. Oh shit! What the hell is that? No shit, Sherlock. What was it? That doesn't look like just water. <laughs> it's no one as slime. Okay. Oh god, what the hell? An event, whatever the fuck it is. It's blood. Now oh, then, looks like I didn't read any reviews on this game. There's blood coming from the ducks. Yeah. Ew. Ew.
Come on, man. Just give me a scratch my nose. It's not working. Point it fucking obvious. Okay, that's how you reload, okay. Press Y to reload. It's been in a fucking vent. Hey, run. Run. Oh, shit. Is there anything else scavenge? No. Oh, fuck. You bastard, you scared the shit out of me. He was on the go around here. What's that? Was that trying to Short it out. Oh, Jesus. The power still works here. They shorted out the power. There's fucking power in that. You're. Oh my God. Great. Great job. Good job. I push this. It says push, but I can't push it. Is there anything worse? Scavenge around here. Oh, we know there's bullets. Handgun ammo. 24. I don't have any herbs. Oh, shit. Ugh, the face is smashed in completely. Isn't that cute? What's that? Parker, give me a hand here. Sure, no problem. That's a Chris. Chris Parker, is that his name? Under God. There's a handgun. I got something. I think it's a gun. Now what? <laughs> He's fat. He looks like a fat man. Look at him. He looks like a fat ass. There's a hand on it. So it's not Chris. Oh, you're looking for Chris, I'm guessing, in your Jill. There's someone behind you. Yo. Get the hell are you? Okay, that's you. Beat his ass, beat his ass, kick it, kick it. Okay. Kill it. Go for, go for Parker. Beat his ass. Is he dead? Kill it. What the fuck, I can't. What the hell? Chris, where are you? I think it was ugly. The hell? Episode 1 Into the Depths. Yep. This is gonna be just peachy. Hopefully, Parker dies and we find Chris. Oh, fuck, I per se. Parker looks fat. It's hard to end on a heart attack than fucking zombies, or whatever the hell these things are. They're infected, I don't know what they are. This sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. It took a full 11 years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never before had solar energy been used to supply power to an entire city. But in 2004, Veltro, a terrorist group opposing the city's development, launched a bioterrorist attack. They not only released a virus, 
but also several creatures known as bioorganic weapons further complicating the situation. It looks like a frog. Launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC, the world's leading counter bioterror organization operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests of any one country, went in as observers to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. Media outlets around the world began to refer to the incident as the Terragrigia Panic. Following the incident, the FBC announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terragrigia remains inaccessible, a silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. Fascinating. Just trying to act professional.